In a dumbbell thruster, we're going to start in a squat position. So having our feet about shoulder width apart, we're going to have our elbows stack just outside of our shoulders. And at this point, we're going to drop into our bottom of the squat position. So we're here, again, making sure that our knees aren't caving in, right? That they're staying over our ankles and that we also aren't getting a lot of forward lean. If you notice people are getting a lot of forward lean here, okay, then simply find them some heel plates, some 12 pound, or sorry, some 10 pound plates, or two by four, or anything that can elevate their heels, and that's gonna help them stay more upright versus leaning forward. At this point, we're gonna cue our people to rip the ground apart, split the ground apart, pushing their knees out, and at the same time, pressing the dumbbells overhead. If they press the dumbbells overhead and their lower back comes forward, we want to cue them to push their ribs down, but we absolutely don't want to see hyperextension in the lower back. And that's how you do a dumbbell thruster.